Hey guys, what's popping is G here. In this video, I wanted to show you a little MMA fight I had with my friend. We did it just for fun. We weren't really competing or anything. We didn't have to be for anything, neither. So we were just basically fooling around and fighting each other. Here's a little video with my own little breakdown of it. So I hope you'll enjoy it. So from over here, the fight starts. We start hopping around, fighting. I start to like body blows and everything. So somewhere over here the angles were a little bad. After those two body blows I laid a hook and a spinning back fist on his face. Then we clinched up and here <laughs> I thought it's going to be power bomb, but he spared me and decided to give me a try. Then he sprawled and got the front headlock. Here's also a really sweet takedown my friend did. It was so cool, but it was so scary at the same time. I would also like to put that we have 10 kilos difference. I am 60 kilos and he's around 70 kilos. So that's the reason why he is absolutely destroying me in the ground game and clinch work. And I'm winning in the, you know, the standing game. I'm, I laid a lot more hits than he did, but... Later in the video he will lay some body blows on me. Over there he laid a pretty good low kick that felt not so good for me. And then I started to hop around and mix the punches with low kicks. Here I laid a jab. Here I laid another jab and a couple of others. There should be a jab cross somewhere in here. There we go. There he swinged wildly and as you can see he hooked my head. We clinched up again and now I started to lay knees on his stomach. There he laid some body blows. My mouse piece almost flew out. Over there he took me in a, you know, bully headlock and I, yeah, couldn't get out of it because of, you know, the weight difference. And he was just neck cranking me and it was pretty painful, but I kept going. Here I decided to take him down to the ground and he kept on holding on me. I could have easily get out of this, but I just let him do that, I don't know. Maybe it was a little dumb, not getting out of it. I would try to stand up, but of course, the 10 kilos difference is just not letting me do a thing. He threw me over and got the top. Thanks God he didn't punch me in the face when he had an opportunity to do this. As you can see, he, is, he was going to do that. Me and him were talking a little bit during the match. Deciding to shift the positions or not. There he tried to, you know, submit me in some weird position. I didn't even know what it is. I tried to get out of this. I might have get a chance. I pushed my head into the stomach so I wouldn't get hit in the head. I didn't hit the back of my head. Then he tried to do somewhat a kimura, I suppose. But I managed to get out of it. I tried to do a buggy choke from me over there. But as you can see, he defended it really well. As you can see, we're all over. I got a little bit of top position. He pushed up the wall a little bit. He tried to do a triangle choke. As you can see, I grabbed his arm. And I tried to do a wrist lock, but I didn't really manage to do that. So he took my head in between his legs. And I took his head over my legs. And we were in this really weird position. So yeah, we ended up in this really weird, really weird position, and over this moment, the video unfortunately ends. Yeah, we didn't fought for the end of the video or anything, we didn't really get a lot of from this. We just had some fun, okay, we just wanted to do it for fun as well. Besides, it was pretty cold, so we didn't manage to roll anymore. So thanks y'all for watching, hope you all enjoyed this little breakdown we had. Watch my videos, please, and music videos as well.